So if you haven't seen the news yet, Neymar is going to Saudi Arabia, I'm pretty sure he's going to Al Hilal, is the club where he's going. So let me know down in the comment section what your thoughts are about that. But it's gonna be very very cool if we see at the end of the at the end of the game, at the end of FIFA on Ball, I think we should see some end of era cards and Neymar is definitely gonna be in there because it's pretty much an end of era for him, not only his PSG career but his um, Europe career as well and not only Neymar Jr but a lot of, a lot of other players have changed club, uh, clubs of course. For example, Benzema, Messi, uh, Kante, and all the other players. Let me know down in the comment section which end of era cards you want to see. Ronaldo has changed uh, just changed clubs, but it was in the winter, so I don't think he's going to get a card. Sergio Ramos is another decent one who might get a card because he is no longer playing for PSG. But yeah, it's quite sad that a lot of players are going to Saudi Arabia, at least in my opinion, because the only reason they're going there is because of money, let's be honest. Nobody cares about Ellen Gals. They just want money. But uh, yeah, I definitely get it. I definitely get players wanting to go there for money. But yeah, obviously like Mane, uh, as well as uh, Brozovic, I mean, go with Savage, all these young players, uh, Neves as well, all these, uh, not, not young, but like prime players, not only Ronaldo and Benzema, who are quite old, when they're uh, 28, 27, 26 year olds, uh, less than 30 year olds, when they're as well. But make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, please, that would be very, very much appreciated, and that would help me out, uh, help me out a lot. Right now, we don't have that many exchanges, really, we've got these two uh, retro stars exchanges as well as hero exchanges which nobody really cares about i don't think so at least if you've got like um, untradeable hero players you can use them to open these packs but not really that great and we've got coin exchanges of course but i think we should get new end of era ones um always or last couple of times when we go into fera players end of era exchanges and found ball we didn't get just one end of era card we got a couple of end of era, end of era cards at the same time and I think that's what she, no, that's what they should do. They should give out give out Neymar, Messi, Benzema, Kante. All they should give out cards in the four cards to all of them. Mane, maybe Brozovic and Neves as well. But the main ones, the main ones are obviously Messi, Neymar, Benzema, and Kante. I would put uh, in the main ones as well. Let's go ahead and look at how Neymar's end of era card is gonna look then if he comes out. Here it is then. I think 115 overall is alright. I think they can definitely give them. Uh, give Neymar higher overall card, but with the end of era cards, they always gave out like lower overalls than what's meta right now. So I went with 115 overall, and I think they should definitely make all these end of era cards if they are gonna release it, of course, um, completely gettable free to play. Um, like they should not really, they should not put a lot of requirements for the exchange, and they should just give out and give them out pretty much for free. One fifteen overall Neymar. Everyone would love to use that card, of course. He just got, he has just got one sixteen overall retro stars card, but yeah, free exchange uh, end of era Neymar is gonna be great. I went ahead and made a messy one as well. One seventeen overall. Um, if they give give these players end of era cards in a couple of weeks, like in two weeks, three weeks, they might even give out like one eighteen, one nineteen, even one twenty overall cards for Messi, for example. Uh, but yeah, definitely a lot of people will be excited, even though it's the end of the game. A lot of people will be excited to use uh, use a good Neymar card, good Messi card, and other players as well who have had end of era pretty much. Would be a nice addition for me, I think, just before uh, preseason or uh, EA founders or whatever it is, the new event that we're gonna get um, on 24th of August or after that even, after that. Um, or maybe they're gonna release that at the same time with that last event in FIFA Mobile. That would be quite decent, I think. But let's go ahead and open. I, I don't think I opened my Retro Stars pack. No, not Retro Stars. This Ranking Star, right? I have not opened this Ranking Star pack. So that's what I'm gonna do right now. I can get a 108 to 115 overall player as well as 500 skill boost, 1000 gems, and 10 million coins. So let's go ahead and open that and let's see what we're gonna pack. Hopefully somebody great. This one is untradeable, unfortunately, but yeah, we'll see what we can... No walkout. That's so sad. I don't think I'll go one walkout from ranking star rewards. 109 overall Silas. Okay, Silas. I mean, I know him from Danny Arons, of course, mostly. But yeah, I'm not, I'm not really that happy with that. I'm not really that happy with that. So I'm, I'm going to go ahead and play a head-to-head -head match in this video on. Because why not? I haven't played a division rival head to head match uh, in quite a long time. I have played uh, challenge mode, of course, but let's go ahead and get into it. We're playing against, oh, Brasilia. Mm, that's not great for me. That's my team right there with Guara at left wing. 
and this is his team. I mean, he's got a decent team. He's got Paladar, Ronaldo, R9 Ronaldo. Not a bad team for him. So let's go ahead and win that if we can. That would be great. Um, Salah to Kevin De Bruyne. Kevin De Bruyne is going to pass it to Bernardo. Then Socrates. Let's wait until everyone is open. Bernardo Silva to close that. Closer to Cafu. Then De Bruyne. Could have passed it there too close, I think. But we can pass it to Bernardo now. It's Ake now, and I think that's a goal from... No, good save from the goal a little before. Kobo, let's go Kobo. Kobo is such a good goalkeeper. To uh, De Bruyne, Bernardo Silva, too close. I'm not playing that well, but my players aren't really passing the ball around that well either. Um, Fofana. Oh no, Pele. N how did that go through? How did that pass go through? Doesn't make any sense to me. Does not make any sense to me. None of my defenders decided to defend there. Not a great goal to concede. I was attacking the whole game. What Bastoni just stood there for some reason. He didn't. He didn't want to make a tackle or anything. Not even pressure the uh, the or not, uh, pressure the attacker, which is Ronaldo. Uh, De Bruyne to Salah. Yeah, my my passes aren't great. How is De Bruyne not making that pass? Right, we are losing one 0 in the first half. That's not great. I need to score at least two goals to make a comeback without without conceding a goal. Which is going to be a big ask, but I'm going to try to do it. Vinicius Jr., De Bruyne with a good tackle. Still, De Bruyne. We're going to pass it to Bernardo Silva. De Bruyne, come on, man. Make better passes. Close We're going to just shoot the ball. Kobel makes a save. Of course, Kobel makes a save. He's such a good goalkeeper. Right, we're going we're gonna to cross the ball to Socrates now. Socrates did not want to header that. Didn't even jump. Not sure why, but he decided to do that. So what can I do about that? Nothing really. That's my throw in then. I can't believe I didn't score at least one goal in this in this game so far. Bernardo to Salah. Salah to De Bruyne. De, Bru De Bruyne is losing the ball all the time. He's never making an accurate, pa accurate pass in this in this game. I, and I don't know what's happening because he's most most of the times he's good for me. Plays well. His passing is great. But in this game, not really. Oh, bam. There we go. De Bruyne. Is he going to score a goal though for me? Too slow. He's too slow for the uh, for for attack, I guess. Yeah. I'm not happy with this game so far. I think I, I should definitely be winning it. But I'm not. De Bruyne. De Bruyne to Bernardo Silva. Bernardo Silva is against Akea. That has got to be a goal. Finally, we scored a goal. 1-1. One, one. We've got 15 in-game minutes pretty much. To score the second goal. Finally, an accurate pass from um, De Bruyne as well. Finally, good pass from him. And Bernardo Silva does a good job scoring there as well. There we go. Fofana to Hernandez. Hernandez to Vinic Vinicius Jr. Then Pele is going to pass it to Ronaldo. The league to make a tackle. Oh, oh. Saliba, nice. He blocked it. Saliba is such a good defender as well. To Bernardo Silva, this is the last chance for me. This is the last chance. I'm going to try to score it, but we'll see. Close it. We're going to pass it to Salah. Salah against uh, Hulit. Open up fake shot to Socrates. Socrates, that's a pen. That's a pen. Last minute pen. There we go. We're going to win that match then. Wow. Wow. Salah, I'm definitely not going to shoot it in the middle. I'm going to 100% score that. And there we go. At the end, we did make a comeback. Socrates, I can't lie. He took a little bit long to, to shoot there. But we did get a penalty after all. And Salah buries it, of course, from the penalty spot. 2-1. Very, very happy with that. And that's going to be the end of the video for today. Is it, is it the end, though? Yes, it is. Make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed it. And peace.